Okay, so I got this uh, Hobby King Red Brick 30 Amp speed controller and went to program it and surprise, the instructions were basically worthless. None of the beep codes um, made any sense with what it was doing. So, uh, found these instructions on Hobby King that are different that seem to work and uh, I'll give you a quick run through of it um, it moves pretty fast so before I plug in the battery I can get this going we'll take a quick look here so what you got here is you go into uh, option mode and it gives you all these beeps so you can see first beep is brake, second beep is battery type, and such and so forth. So it'll do the first beep. You got like maybe a second or two to uh, put the throttle stick in the down position to select this. Then you go to this menu. You got one, two, or three beeps for some of them. So for instance, we're going to go uh, into the brake mode by moving the stick from the up to the down position and then under brake mode you'll have either one beep or two beeps one beep for off two beeps for on so then what you'll do to select this you'll be in the down position you move it back up and then it'll give you a verification tone uh, basically signaling that your input was uh, accepted and then it'll move on to the next one uh, and such and so forth um, now I'm going to videotape this, it happens really fast, so bear with me for a second here. So the first thing that you're going to do, or at least for my particular radio here, is plug in the battery, flip this all the way up, turn the radio on, and what is it doing? There it goes. Two beeps. There we go. Okay. First beep is brake. I don't want to set that. Two beeps. Battery type. Move it down. One beep. Lithium. Up. Verification tone. Cutoff mode. I don't need to set that. Cutoff threshold. Startup mode. Timing. I want to do that. And one beep low. Two beeps medium. Three beeps high. Good to go. Set all to default. I don't want to do that. Two long beeps exit. And we're ready to rock and roll. Now, as you can see, I can spool up the motor. And that is how you do it. Uh, hopefully, that didn't seem too fast or anything like that, but uh, you can comment on this video and I'll give you any help I can give you.